who has a stronger case to make? That's probably the question. Jared Goff or Tua Tunga Viola or Trevor Lawrence, who can realistically ask for the most money out of those three? I actually think Goff can. And I would take him over those guys. I just, he's done it, Ty. I, to me, like yeah. to what you just said, he's done it. He is, he, he, you know, he's going through the heartbreak. He's been in the Super Bowl heartbreak. 29. Last year was heartbreak. 29. He's right in the prime. Yeah. He's fine. He's better than those two. I, I'm with you on that. Like, I like, that's what I'm saying. I think the way we're talking this through, he's going to be, they're going to have to make, he's going to have to be the highest paid guy. At some point, we've got to give Jared Kopp some credit, though, too. Right. In LA, it was all Sean McVay, system quarterback. You know, basically written off as as a robot, right? Just this AI quarterback <laughs> who's just doing whatever Sean McVay says. <clears throat> he was always more than that, and he's proven it in Detroit. And this was a team they they tore down to the studs with Dan Campbell and Brad Holmes. They they wanted their own type of player, one through fifty three, and he was the quarterback from day one. He went three ten and one in year one. Nine and eight in year two, 12 and five last year. He's thrown for over 4,400 yards in each of the last two years. 59 touchdowns, 19 interceptions. Uh, is he athletic? No. Is he aesthetically pleasing? No. Who cares? I just right. looked up their backup quarterbacks. Holy shit, I wish I was Jared Goff right now. <laughs> Hendon Hooker, <laughs> Nate Sudfeld. Fifty-five and a half, fifty-five and a half mil a year, and be able to play this way for a long time. At he's twenty-nine, he turns thirty in October. Th this is a game that I believe will age well, especially with the direction of the NFL. It's not like th that contract would backfire financially, right? Like not he's the they're he's not running they're around having... taking shots. No, they're fine. They're they're going to be. They're competing every year with this team. They're loaded up. The offensive line's loaded to protect. You have to protect a quarterback that can't move, and they can. And they can run the ball. 